two, one, Tetris. It's the finals, guys. That's crazy. It's finals. Ryan holding out real bad for that L. Never got it. Wanted that tuck resolve on the side of the stack. Now it just wants to clean up this well. <coughs> Sorry, oh my gosh. That sneezing fit did a number on me, man. Exposing a long bar dependency and does get a long bar to fill it. And now has a little overhang tuck setup thing, possibly looking for a T. Ooh, mix it into a T spin, gets the T spin. You know, I suppose neither player has played impeccable Tetris up until this point. Uh, Dan has been locked in a bit of a, uh, a dig for a while. And uh, Ryan, having started off with one, is only at 73,000 points, so Dan getting that Tetris going up to 90,000 is uh, hanging on in here. So sorry. Oh my god. I thought I was done. I thought the sneezing was over. Please. Okay. If I if I sneeze again, I swear to god, I'm gonna riot. Um <clears throat> Jeez. That long bar for the the right, uh trying to fill it out. Now Tetris ready. Dan getting a dirty Tetris to there playing two off the bottom right now and just chooses to commit to it not wanting to risk efficiency boom another dirty tetris there for dan going up to 191,000 points ryan at 192 taking a tetris here 215 the player's very close in score and uh you know decent ways through transition we're at uh 70 lines, just about. Brian, with a little bit of, uh, mm, RNG to deal with, uh, is now set up for a dirty Tetris as a result. Ooh, boy. So the Tetris isn't gonna happen just yet. Oh, a uh, miscalculation. Uh, yeah, yeah, miscalculation, I'll call it. Uh, Ryan, with a bit of panic, is gonna top out at 268,000 points, which means, Dan, you are good for game number one of this finals matchup. Have I told you guys it's the finals enough yet? Guys. This is it. No, I don't think Dan is facing the right way. I feel Three, two, one, Tetris.
Do I often do commentary? Uh, I do I do pretty frequent commentary. I used to hold uh, six hour marathons where I just took every match I could. Um, I also have done stuff for Cursed Tetris League. I used to be CTL's biggest streamer. Um, I obviously I do TNP. Uh, for those of you who don't know, Tetris for non-pros uh, is for all non-max out players. We're always looking for new people to join. I, uh, I help host that with the uh, lovely Sunny Disposition and Snow Lily, as well as Arbaro, all incredible people. Y'all check out TNP if you're thinking about joining uh, Comp Tetris. It's a great place to start. Just like a score update is a great place to start for these players. Am I right, guys? Dan currently sitting at 142,000 points. Ryan at 144,000 points. Both players, Tetris ready. And that's a Tetris for Ryan and a Tetris for Dan. Wow, look at that. They're, they sure know how to, to stack. But yes, I used to do a lot more commentary than I do these days. I think these days my focus is mostly on uh, uh, helping manage a TNP and taking matches when I can, when it when is convenient. Uh, you know, I, I also have a life outside of um, streaming as well, so I uh, have not restreamed as much as I'd like to, and that's okay. Sometimes it's like that. I also just spent two weeks sick. Ryan, not wanting to create a longbar dependency, chooses to work around that deep hit that was in the board, but is now Tetris ready as a result. Just waiting on the long bar. On the other hand, Dan, I'm gonna take a nice little safety. Finally gets the long bar for the Tetris. Was waiting for a little while. Not long enough to cause any huge disparity though. We have uh Beautiful little double burn there, cutting away nicely at the stack to uh, to keep from having to burn all the way down just to score another Tetris. Uh, some nice forethought there for Ryan. Very intelligent play. Look at him go. Dan stacked up high, but does get the Tetris. And is now just gonna clean up this well, it looks like. And there we go, transferring it right back to the right. Right back to the right is a funny sentence. Dan, taking this Tetris, uh, going up to 376,000 points, and on the other side, Ryan sitting at 370,000 points. These players really not giving each other breathing room. Can't even, uh, you can't even pause for a second without the other trying to create some kind of lead, both playing very, very efficiently for the most part. Nice little Corian thing there for Dan. Do, do, do the kids still like the Corian thing? Is that still what's, is that still popular? I know the Vitz is like the adjustment right now. Like everybody's, everybody joneses for delayed Vitz setups for some reason. I hate the Vitz. I think it's just another long bar dependency. It's dumb. It's stupid. Don't Vitz. Uh, anyway. That being said, Corian thing's still cool. Honestly, I can't lie. Five and below is my favorite, so I won't say the Corian thing is the best move, but I do like a Corian thing. I think they look very cool. But the five and below is my favorite. Absolute favorite. All-time favorite. Yeah, I, it's so good. Perfect S-spin there from Ryan. Ooh, followed by a misdrop, though is able to snag this Tetris nonetheless. Now has a long bar dependency on the stack to contend with. And contend, contend he shall. Fills it. Just gonna try to bring this back down. Uh, both players coming up on transition, both at 520. Jesters, vaguely. 
526 uh, for Ryan, and transitioning is Dan here at 5... Uh, I think it was like 550, but now the score is 571. And is now Tetris ready. And having to take that last burn, Ryan set up for a Tetris. Very, very set up for a Tetris. Doesn't get the long burn time, though. And is now, uh, now in dig mode. Oh, and there we go. Well uncovered. Gets the long bar for the Tetris with a, uh, a new long bar, de long bar dependency now on the left. Gets it filled. Tetris ready, waiting. Oh, Tetris ready and waiting. No longer. Both players uh, in uncomfortable positions. Oh, and that's going to be a top out at 589 for Dan. And right, oh, right there at 575 for Ryan. Dan able to keep, keep the lead just barely. Three, two, one, Tetris. I wasn't saying one delay itself is three minutes. I'm saying the delay they're getting is going to be su substantially longer than when I say things. Because I said it, like, right as Dan was topping out. I, I said that he, he was topping out, you know. So the fact that it was long enough for someone to complain about me not saying it, despite the fact that I had said it, Oh yeah, no, I don't. I don't think. I don't think anybody should be upset about the censoring of the word bits. I, I think people shouldn't do them. Uh, a little bit of a little bit of a suffer start here for Dan. Both players not in great positions, actually. Um, Ryan's board with stuff. A long bar is gonna help. No matter what the case is, the long bar is gonna help in some way. Uh, trying to keep weight off of the whole question mark? That T piece is gonna do it. Opens up this now unconventional well, slams it down, gets the Tetris, goes up to 129,000 points. And Dan, just high up on the board, digging for his life. Has the well back open. Is Tetris ready? Playing one off the bottom. Does get the long bar for the Tetris. And another going up to 103,000 points. There's a Tetris there for Ryan, going up to 201,000 points, and another make it 223. And uh, Dan did have a T-spin set up, but went ahead and burned it out as he was holding out for the T uh, a little longer than maybe he's comfortable doing. Opening that well back up, slamming down a column seven? Six. Column six. Tetris, I think. I know how to commentary. Look at me. I I have I've watched a Tetris. 269, 292. There for Ryan had a Tetris right as I was gonna hey now. Um On the other side, Dan, two twenty-four.
Nice adjustment there from Ryan to make this well accommodating, well, board accommodating. Sweet potato, stop it. Sorry, my dog. Anyway, uh, Dan sitting at 289, no, with that Tetris, make it 301,000 points. On the other side, we have Ryan, who's currently sitting at 377,000 points. Taking a Tetris there, and another Ryan, 424. Dan having to take a couple of burns here, trying to uh, trying to open up this well, has been buried with a with a nice little layer of garbage. But uh, that triple's gonna open it up, and uh, Tetris ready is Dan. Gets the long bar, and you guessed it, the Tetris and another 406 for Dan, 475 for Ryan. There's a Tetris there for Ryan going up to 503. One more. Technically, two more uh, Tetris is available if absolutely perfect. But uh, a burn's inevitable here. With that burn, gonna transition at 527. And is Tetris ready? Gets the long bar. 554. And on the other side, Dan really ooh, in a tough spot doesn't get that long bar over and that's going to be a top out at 446,000 points quite the suffer for Dan which means Ryan is good for his first heart avoiding the sweep altogether Ryan, you are good for the game. Dan has topped out. You have acquired heart. You're In three, two, one. Tetris. From this point forward, no matter what happens, we will be at match point until it's over. In this instance, it is in Dan's favor. Ryan's gonna be looking to make it a decider. Ryan taking that Tetris and then once again uh, cutting around this uh, this little hole to um, to avoid extra unneeded unnecessary burns opens this well back up and gets the Tetris but uh, it worked out. Boxmeal asking if we can go to game five so they can crack open a decider. Well, a decider, I should say. Look, I don't. These players aren't here. Ooh. 
I was gonna say, these players aren't the excuse for your alcoholism. Uh, if you want to drink, drink. But Dan is in a really tough spot here, so they might be. Dan getting these pieces over just barely. Some absolutely insane survival way up top here. I don't drink, I was just gonna drink an apple cider. Oh my god. Dan makes it out of that, and Ryan has topped out at uh, 99,000 points. Which means this is a chase down? Uh, 99,000 points is your goal? I don't know what happened. Overshot the square, ah, I see. Give me 100,000 and it's yours for sure. Just trying to open this well back up and there it is. There's a Tetris, 85,000 points. There sure was some pace in this game. And there it is. That's a, that's a spot secured in futures for Dan. Look at that. How does, how does this, how does it do it? Is it, is it a, is it like this? Yeah, there you go. You're on the big screen, boy. Go. Hey everybody, this is your old pal Van Dweller, host of Classic Tetris Monthly. If you like this video, hit thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like it, please subscribe and bang that notification bell. And follow us on Twitch at twitch.tv slash monthly Tetris. Thank you and have a nice day.